In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to add B-roll in Descript. So chances are you have your video in Descript and you're trying to figure out how to add B-roll to your video, right? Step number one is to obviously upload your video into Descript. This is what it should look like. You have your transcription here on the left and you're, uh, you've are you just got done editing or whatever. And what we wanna do is add B-roll to your video. So what I tend to do is I click on this the to look at the timeline. See down here in the left-hand corner where it says show and hide timeline. Click on that, hide the timeline, show timeline. And again, depending on what video you watch, uh, it's gonna look different because Descript has been updating a lot. So make sure you have the newest version of Descript because this is it. All right, so now that you have opened the video editing timeline, what we wanna do here is to go on over to the right hand side navigation and down here, it's like the sixth one down. See over here under the Underlord nav, it says media. Click on media, click that button here. And then first here, it says stock video. So what I tend to do is just click on show all. And then what you can do here is you can search for what type of niche or what type of stock footage you want. Let's just do technology. So click enter. And all we have to do here, guys, is search for which B-roll that you want. And all you do is click on the video and then drop and drag it down to the editor timeline. And yes, there's like 15 different ways to do this in Descript, but I find this to be the easiest because if you can see the editing timeline, it's easier to edit. So let's left click, drop and drag, and then bring it down to the editor where you want it to be located. Then just let go of the left click and then it's going to load it. And you're gonna hear your computer fans start moving because this is gonna push your CPO. And what you wanna do here is just click the play button and take a look at what this B-roll looks like, right? So click play. And what you wanna do here is I tend to have the B-roll only last three seconds, a little advice to you because if you want your viewer retention to be as best as possible. Uh, so what we're gonna do here is we're going to drop and drag this clip so that it's only three seconds long. And you can watch it. And what you can do here is just drop and drag a couple of B-roll clips and then just click and watch it. I, uh, a little advice to you though, to, I would have this B-roll clips maybe like three, three to four seconds long. And what's cool is you can just click on the whole clip and then drop and drag it and move the location. Okay, so let's let's have this a little bit longer. My advice to you, and again, I have 10 YouTube channels that have been doing, I do this full time. Having your B-roll three to four seconds max is going to be ideal. So, okay, so let's click this. This is my video and this is a test video. S See how that B-roll kind of like gets broken up? So what I tend to do is a front facing camera video. And then what I'll do is I'll just break it up with a bunch of B-roll. And then you just go back and forth. Uh, three or four seconds of your front face, three or four seconds of the B-roll, then back to your face, then back, and then you just go back and forth. And again, people have different recipes, but the goal here uh, is to gain retention and keep it if you wanna last on YouTube. I find this to be the easiest way to just drop and drag the B-roll onto here, and then you can just kinda like click on the, the length of it and just look at the editing timeline. Is it, you know, where does the clip start? It starts at about 12 seconds. So what we wanna do here is add up 12, 13, 14, 15. So have it turn off at 15 seconds to have three seconds of B-roll. And I know you're probably not looking for this advice right now, but um, it's gonna help you guys, I promise. So click on the clip and then drop and drag it out. All right, so let's watch this quick. This Chris and this is my group. This is my video and this is a test video. This is my test video on how to do this. This is a tutorial video. See, that looks, pretty that looks pretty good, right guys? Again, this is how to add B-roll using Descript. This is the most updated version. Check out the description for all links in there. I have courses on how to YouTube and you can also hire me to help you with stuff and uh, affiliate links. I'll see you in the next one, guys. Peace.